it's Tony from Type 5 Reviews, and today we're going to be taking a look at how I prepare my mulch beds without any landscaping fabric. To start, you'll want to lay out and define the edges of your mulch bed. I've decided to use my Ryobi edger to form a nice peanut shape around these two evergreen trees in my front yard. I then used a flat-headed shovel to dig out the grass from my new mulch bed. This is definitely the hardest part of the process, but I wanted to make sure that I started with a fresh surface before laying down the new mulch. There's got to be an easier way. Off camera, it took about two hours to dig out that entire area, but I'm happy with the way that it turned out and can move on to the next step. Since I wasn't able to completely remove all of the grass and weeds from underneath my mulch area, I decided to spray it down with glyphosate, which is just Roundup weed and grass killer. Ideally, I would have marked out and sprayed this ahead of time to kill any grass and weeds, but I wanted to finish this project a little bit sooner, so I decided to spray after. Just make sure to be really careful of where you're spraying this, and don't walk on it before it dries because it can transfer to your shoes and ruin your good grass. Now the secret to keeping your mulch beds weed free without having to put down any landscaping fabric first is to use a product called Preem. I've had a lot of success with keeping weeds out of my mulch beds by using this product, and it's really easy to apply. You can use a cheap spreader like I am to apply a nice even coat around your mulch bed, and you don't have to worry about it harming your grass. You will want to avoid the leaves of established plants like hostas, but if you do get any on them, just brush it off and continue with the process. While we check out this work so far, if you learned anything, give this video a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this in the future. Now that the mulch bed is prepped, we can finally start laying out our mulch. To keep the weeds out, the second key is to use a really thick layer of mulch. I like to start from scratch with a 4 inch thick mulch bed, which turns out to be about the thickness of a bag of mulch. As you can see here, I've laid out about roughly 45 bags of mulch. While that might be a lot, it'll create a nice thick bed to keep all of those weeds out. Finally, just spread out the mulch, and that's it. I'm really happy with the way this project turned out, and I hope to see you all again on the next one.